Hello friends, Satyendra here and in this video, let's create the section view within the drawing in Creo Parametric. So let's get started. So usually we don't follow this technique. We first create all the sections within the part and then we just call these sections directly to the drawing. So here in this video, we'll see both the techniques one by one. So let's do this. Now I have already posted a long video about the section view where I have covered all type of sections in detail, including local section, full section, half sections, 3D sections, everything. So you can go to my channel and look for this. Now how to create sections within the drawing. So let's say I want a full section to this drawing view where the section line is passing through this. So in that case, when you are creating a section view to this drawing view, just double click this drawing view go to sections, go for 2D cross section, then you simply go for this plus symbol, click it here. Here you have multiple options, but here we will just use planar and offset. So planar and single is selected now, just say done and then you add the section name. So let's say my section is section A, enter. Now since it is a planar section, you need to select a plane here. So just switch on the datum planes and then select the suitable datum plane. So in my case, this is a plane I need to select. So I'll just select this. The section view is created here. Just apply it, say OK. Switch off the datum planes. And the section is added to this drawing view. Same way, if you don't need the full section for this drawing view, you just need half section for the view. Then just double click the drawing view. Once again, go to the sections. Now here instead of full, you go for half. Now for half, let's say I need this area to be covered inside the section view. So from this datum plane, this side. So in that case, once again, you need to switch on the datum plane. And then this time, you need to select this datum plane. You see the arrow direction. This is the area I need the section. Just apply it. Say OK. Switch off the datum plane. So this is how we create the planar section for full view or half view directly inside the drawing. Now let's create a full section for this drawing view, calling the section directly from the part. So for that, first I'll go to this part. Now see here, I have added section A inside the drawing. Now I'll create section B inside the part. So for that, go to view, go for sections, inside that select planar, once again, switch on the datum plane and then you select a suitable datum plane. So in my case, this is the plane I need to select. So I'll select like this. I'll just flip this direction. I will rename this section as section B. I'll say OK. Now from here, I'll just deactivate it. I'll switch off the datum plane. And now I'll go to the drawing. Now once again, I'll just double click this drawing view. I'll go to the sections, 2D cross sections, plus mark. And from here, I'll just select the section B. Now this section B, I have created inside the part and I'm just calling inside the drawing. So I'll select this section. I'll apply it. I'll say OK. So see, I have created section A directly inside the drawing and I have created section B inside the part and called to the drawing. So these are the two techniques we use to create section view in Creo Parametric. Now if you see these two techniques, first technique looks a bit confusing and that is why the second technique is more preferable. We all follow the second technique. Now let's see the offset section. Now to create the offset section within the drawing, it is much more confusing. So let's see that. So first I will remove this section from this drawing view. So for that, go to sections, say no section, apply it. So the section is removed from that drawing view, say OK. Now I'm going to create a offset section to this drawing view. Once again, double click it, go for sections, go for 2D cross section plus go for create new 
go for offset done give the section name so let's say it is section c say enter the moment you say enter it moves back to the part i'll just select this plane say okay default i'll say normal now let's say my section line is passing through this like this and then like this i'll just say okay and once again it will move back to the drawing just apply it say okay so this is the offset section you have added to this drawing view it is section c this is again more confusing and that is why we don't follow these techniques i'll just remove it now the same section i will create from the part so let's say i'll first delete it now when you create the offset section from the part it is much easier go for sections go for offset section define select this face sketch normal draw the line so i'll start from here i'll go like this and then let's say the section line is like this just say okay flip the direction go for properties rename the section say okay so your offset section is created within the part here i will just deactivate it i'll go to the drawing now you just double click to this drawing view go for sections go for 2d cross section plus and select the section c so this time i have created section c within the part and i'm calling it to the drawing just apply it okay you have added offset section to this drawing view now once section view is added you need to add the section line so to add the section line go for this option arrow select the section view and select the section line view section line will be created if you have a planar section go for arrow select the section and select the section line view so this is how we create section view within the drawing in creo parametric and i hope this video will be helpful now you can like this video if you find this video helpful and you can subscribe to the channel to support the channel and i'll see you in my next video thank you